Uh, as you're aware, Mary Lou, uh, Shane Ross has written a biography of your good self, and in it he's posed questions about the, the source of funding for the, the renovation of your family home. I suppose, would you like to clarify those questions that he has posed in that book? How did you pay for the renovation of your home? And, and also, why didn't you cooperate with the book? You, you met with Shane Ross prior to him undertaking the project, and you decided in the end, and he said after you consulted with the people, uh, that you didn't want to cooperate with the book. Why, why didn't you? And, and who did you consult with? So, you see, Shane Ross writing a book about me is a bit like is a bit like me on my summer holidays deciding that I'd write a book on the T-shirt and then giving him a ring and saying, "Would you like to cooperate and give me an interview?" I mean, I, I uh, from the get-go, I said to Shane, I, "I just don't think that this is um, a project that I would be interested in being involved with." Um, so he's aware of that. I'm very lucky that we have a family home. I'm really conscious of that. There's lots of people who, who can't say that. We have a single home, our family home in Cabra. We paid for it the way all working people pay for their family home. We have a mortgage and we're still paying it, folks, and we'll be paying it for quite some time. That's it. That's, that's the beginning, the middle, and the end. We suggest the renovation would cost several hundred thousand euro. I, would you like listen, to clarify? Listen, he can suggest what he wants. It's my family home, okay. the single home that we have, that we've raised our kids in. We have a mortgage on it. We pay our mortgage. We pay our bills. We pay our dues. That's who we are, like all other working people. That's it. That's the story.